Hello, everyone. Welcome back for a brand new episode of Collider Ladies Night. I am very happy right now because I am sitting across from, wait for it, for the star of Final Destination 3. <laughs> Everybody out there knows that I am obsessed with that franchise, really? so I had to mention it at some Whoa. point. But no, we have one of the stars of Gemini Man here, Mary Elizabeth Winstead. Thank you so much for visiting us Thank today. Thank you for having me. What are the technical challenges for you of working with two Will Smiths in Gemini Man? Well, there were there were a few interesting aspects to it. I mean, one just you know, I'm sure you've talked to people who've done motion capture work, and so that was my first time doing that. So it was interesting. Every time I was in a scene with both versions of Will Smith in the film, um, we would shoot the scene with Will and his double. It would be with Will and Will. <laughs> it would be with Will and nothing. You know, it would be like, it was just all these different versions. And then at the end of the movie, at the end of the schedule, we went into this motion capture studio and we redid all of those scenes. So, so it was like, it was just a lot of, of work on the, the same scene in, in various, various ways. Did you always know you wanted to grow up and be an actor or a performer, or was there ever a point in your life when you said, like, I don't know, I want to grow up and be a doctor or a lawyer or something like that? I got lucky that I, I, I think it took me like a year, it was like 18 to 19, I didn't work at all, and that was like, I was like, do I go to college? Do I just give up? What do I do? And then when I was 19, I got this movie Sky High, which was like this Disney I do remember kids that. movie, and that was like, okay, you did it. And then after that, I never, I never really went very long without working. So I just, I got very lucky. And a very special thank you goes to our guests of honor and the recipients of our first ever Hero of the Year award, the Commander and Jetstream. If you got the opportunity to revisit any of your past roles in a sequel, prequel, you name it, what would it be and why? You know, maybe it would be Ramona Flowers. I think it would be interesting to see like where she is 10 years later. I like, would be totally open to that. As a character. Like, I, I, I just think that would be an interesting exploration. Uh, Scott Pilgrim? So do you want to go out sometime? Um, no, that's okay. You just need to sign for this. So we are, of course, sitting on the set of Collider Ladies Night, so I do have to ask about Birds of Prey. I know the rules, no specifics, but I yes. do really want to know what it's like working on the set of a film where you were working entirely with a female ensemble with a director like Kathy at the helm. Can you feel the difference on a set like that? It was so much fun, and yeah, you totally can. I mean, it was just so easy. There was no ego in any of it. I mean, not to say that ego is a male-only trait, it's certainly not, but in this case, it was just so easy. Everybody just wanted to be there, wanted to be with each other, wanted to be playing these roles. And it was exciting. It was exciting. Like everything about it was so cool, like the costumes and, and Kathy like really being at the helm of it and really making these decisions like that she thought were cool as opposed to going, well, we got to appeal mm -hmm. to this person. We got to appeal to that person. We got to, it was really like, she had the reins and like Margot was super involved in a collaborative way, but it was all just like, what do we think is cool? Like not how we, not, not like, but are guys gonna think this is sexy or is that, you know, the, we didn't have any of those questions. Mm -hmm. It was just like, what do we think is cool? Gemini Men hits theaters October 11th. Check it out. Thank you so much for being here Thank today Thank you so again. much. Thank you guys for watching this edition of Collider Ladies Night. Do not leave without like and sharing this interview. And guess what? We're gonna see you soon with more episodes.